Three lawsuits filed this week in light of a new law accused former priests and a counselor in two Southern California high schools of sexual abuse. Nicole Bonilla says she suffered sexual abuse at the hands of her guidance counselor in the 90s at Modern Day High School in Santa Ana. I will not send my kids to Modern Day ever. That's because according to Bonilla and her attorneys, administrators at the school covered up the alleged act and some are still working at Modern Day. After they asked me all my questions, they said that they were basically going to make sure it never happens again. So I thought that there would be some form of justice or consequence. Bonilla says her parents nor police were ever called. The counselor, Bernie Balsas, gone a few months later. Bonilla showing her face in hopes of giving other alleged victims the courage to speak up as the California Child Victims Act kicks in on New Year's Day. Allow survivors to come forward today, expose their perpetrators, expose institutions who covered this up. And for the next three years, doesn't matter how old the survivor is, he or she can come forward and use this law. They can do that anonymously. Two other plaintiffs filing suits this week choosing to do just that. One anonymous man claims his perpetrator was a former principal at Modern Day, where he was a student, and later at Santa Margarita High, Monsignor Michael Harris. Another man accuses Father Christopher Kearney of abuse while pretending to wrestle. Kearney was stationed at St. Francis High School in La Cañada, Flint Ridge between 1970 and 1995. In statements, both the Archdiocese of L.A. and Orange say both priests are included on published lists of publicly accused priests. The attorneys who filed this lawsuit tell me they believe among the survivors who have not spoken up, many may be from the Latino community because of a cultural stigma associated with speaking out against one's religious leaders. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.